tuli mu parliament elanga eno mukuru mu mukuru balambalu gahale ate agudde uh, mu mbiza omukuru leader of opposition wa form runji gatulina omukuru John Rujoe Senyenyi wa mtabukide ono nabada ageza ko kugamba mbu leader of opposition wa form runji wa murunji Joel Senyenyi mbu alete list ya abantu bonabo na hababu zibwawo mbu bagenda kubanga bakomeze bwawo era abasibe banno bonabo nabo na mbu ngabo bonabo na musebini bwe abasiba mbu agenda kubatambo ono mwami tebu habula ya mutumye Mbwa gambe jore senyo nyi amwele sti ya ba ntubo na ababu zibawo. Jore senyo nyi wa mgambi nti hatewa ganda bafi bachibala ma bo mugenda batu wadi ila bo vali udawa. Kubanga listi tuwajiva wada. Prime Minister Lobna Nabanja na ategeza anga listi enu wajidi na bulunji ila unga wa wamanyi ababu ntubo bafi jivali. Manya ababu ntubo genda newe yogeze nyo kabalo oza ntibia Museveni agenda bawana agenda batendeka ne balamu bimukalide ku maso jore senyo nyesi muntu gomala ogwira ko daru aha oyo yeri do opposition gatulino mulungi omukuru jore senyo nyi ngalaga ko omukuru omukuru balambalu gahale nti byonna bya kutugamba kasasiro mweri deli twagala na kumanya kitwagala kutu abantu bafe aba wambibwa abantu bafe ababuzi bwao tuina baganda bafe abali mukomera ngati baina musango titwagala tubulya nonsense bo mu 7 ya kutumye ebya mu 7 tebitwata ko oyo leader of opposition yo mulungi muve kubano abanonya aba abenonyiza abanonyo kubobo bya abanonya sente abanonyo kuzanyira mani gaba na Uganda ono Joel Senyonyi wanjaulo era tumwe bazanyo mukama afi Joel Senyonyi we bali nyo we bali ledala abantu ano bayina kamanyi lokati ye musebeni we yatudde yalowozeza mbwe kigendo kumuyisawo kwe kugama ati bagenda kuyimbula basiba national platform abasiba ne batugamba okuyimbula basiba bayina musango ki era bala ndoza mission ya muwebe dwambu Ayimbula abana bonna haba kwa atibwa mkaluko mwaka kume bili abili mugu mumbi. Nyo shikina kuzo kwa gazi wa msebeni. Nibata manyanti abana bana haba kwa atibwa. Nilua alo ni walua abana bala haba kwa atibwa. Kwa gamba tufoka sinze kubali haba rudeo na yati inga abana baki nda maso. Nyo kubanga haba kwa atibwa. Joe sonyo nibiabe ganya. Tuka ni baso kwa tu gambe wa John Bosco Chibarama. Nyo mkulu udamira jibari kubanga Bob Prime Minister ya tutegeza nti hama njibali hehe ono joe sonyo nye agenda baso vula mwofi kubali ya adewaza nye katemba ono joe sonyo nye iwa anja ulo agenda kuhuli na mumata I'm sorry, I'm sorry, even I'm sorry. Again, I call him one of the Jewish sons. But I'm calling Kajanja for no reason, because he's running away. He's being got money into your nose, and you're like, "Oh, my God!" Position is here. I'm yet to get it. Andy, Andy, Andy. Andi uh, right 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 on I was speaker. Right right on I was speaker. <laughs> point of order. Point of order. Uh, on, on, right, right, on, right right on I was speaker. Honorable honorable minister. No on honorable colleagues please 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 order order on honorable colleagues the honorable barugara baram i started with whom i know cannot fail to respond to anything so let us feel as if we are protecting him huh? yeah so uh, let the leader of opposition bring his point of order and and we see Thank you, Right Honorable Speaker. Honorable Speaker, I request that you protect me from excited colleagues. Right Honorable Speaker. Please, Honorable Colleagues. Please, Lop. Thank you, Right Honorable Speaker. Uh, firstly, I think we, it's important that as Parliament, we orient our new colleagues on uh, our modus operandi as parliament. 
um, how we operate, point of order, and, and the like. But more importantly, right honorable speaker, the, the point of order that I'm standing up on, we discussed in this very parliament issues of missing persons, some who were disappeared, people who are in jail irregularly, some missing persons for whom the Prime Minister of Uganda acknowledged are in the hands of the state, like John Bosco Chibalama. And we tabled that list here in Parliament. We gave it to the Attorney General. Court is processing many of these matters, and we have asked that they be released on bail, because this is not prosecution, but persecution. Right Honorable Speaker, is it in order for a new minister who seems to be a novice to come with excitement and claim that he has mandate to pursue a matter of people who are simply being persecuted as opposed to being is, is the honorable new minister on, honorable Senyony, you know the language we use in parliament. Okay? On, honorable Senyony, you know the language we use in this parliament. Even when you disagree with a person, language is like a novice. A member of a member of parliament is a member of parliament is a member of parliament. Okay? So honorable Senyony, do the need for you. You're a gentleman. There is a language we don't use here. This is the language we don't use. Right Honorable Speaker, as a lawyer and as somebody who knows English, the word novice means somebody who is new to a profession. No. No. The Honorable Balam Barugahare is a new minister. So the word novice is not derogatory in any way except for people who we need to teach some English. You see, you see, on our colleagues, how we start with problems is how we behave. Okay? Look, you know, I know you would be insulted if I called you a novice. The Honorable Baram Bargara is a minister and a free fledged now ex official of this house who has been sworn in. Okay? So, Honorable, I'm a very patient man, and I know you're a gentleman. Okay? Please, let's use. Right, Honorable Speaker. Right, Honorable Speaker. Right, Honorable Speaker, you asked me to speak. Please protect Please. me from these excited. No, you're protected, Honorable. You're I protected. hope I am. You see, in this parliament, we keep learning, and. Um, I am glad to even teach colleagues some English. When you Google the meaning of the word novice, for those that have smartphones and some data, definition number one, a person new in a job or situation. Balam Barugahari is new, the honorable, is new as a minister, so there's nothing wrong with calling him a novice as a minister. I thank you. Thank procedure, you. procedure, procedure. Thank you, Honorable Clerk. I hereby direct you, sir, you expunge the submission of the Honorable Senior. Honorable Baram, continue, please. Continue. Thank you. Okay. Uh, right, Honorable Speaker. So, during the appointments committee, I was given a task as a fair person who believes in fairness. Uh, with knowledge of my background as a, a patriot to speak to the president who is appointing authority to stand surety for the young men who, who are detained and they have not yet gone on trial. So the president accepted to pardon most of them who, are not, who don't have cases of murder. And he said security forces should, uh, and, and the intelligence should expedite the investigation 
uh, uh, going on. So I will request my brother, uh, Honorable Joro Senyony, to give, right Honorable Joro Senyony, to give me the list. I will do that for you, Joel, and I will make sure the president uh, acts on that. Thank you. Then, okay. Uh, thank you for the opportunity. Thank you. Thank you. I'm capitalizing on the energies that the young people have to offer when centralized in the development process. Uh, right Honorable Speaker, I would also like to thank you and the entire leadership of Parliament for the mentorship and support. I also extend my gratitude to colleagues for the goodwill and I pledge that as a representative of the young people, our pace is set and we look forward to seeing how best Uganda can fully utilize its natural resources to fast track our development. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, honorable Nambozo, Florence. I requested the national unity platform to avail the list. Hope the uh, uh, leader of opposition is here. I'm yet to get it. Yeah. And the... Uh, and the... Uh, and the... Uh, <laughs> and the... Uh, right, right, right on our speaker. Right, right on our speaker. <laughs> Point of order. Point of order. Uh, on, on, right, on, right, on, right, honorable speaker. Honorable, honorable minister. No. On, honorable colleagues, please, 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 please. Order. Order. On, on, honorable colleagues. The honorable Barugara Baram, I studied with whom I know, cannot fail to respond to anything. So let us feel as if we are protecting him. Huh? Yeah. So uh, let the leader of opposition bring his point of order, and and we we'll see. Thank you, right honourable speaker. Honourable speaker, I request that you protect me from excited colleagues. Right honourable speaker. Please, Honorable colleagues. Please, Lop. Thank you, Right Honorable Speaker. Uh, firstly, I think we, it's important that as Parliament, we, we orient our new colleagues on uh, our modus operandi as Parliament. Um, how we operate, point of order, and, and the like. But more importantly, Right Honorable Speaker, the Right, the point of order that I'm standing up on, we discussed in this very parliament issues of missing persons, some who have disappeared, people who are in jail irregularly, some missing persons for whom the Prime Minister of Uganda acknowledged are in the hands of the state, like John Bosco Chibalama. And we tabled that list here in parliament. We gave it to the Attorney General. Court is processing many of these matters and we have asked that they be released on bail because this is not prosecution but persecution. Right Honorable Speaker, is it in order for a new minister who seems to be a novice to come with excitement and claim that he has mandate to pursue a matter of people who are simply being persecuted as opposed to being Honorable is, is the Honorable New Minister Honorable you know the language we use in Parliament Okay 
Honorable Senyon, you know the language we use in this parliament. Even when you disagree with a person, language is like a novice. A member of a member of parliament is a member of parliament is a member of parliament. Okay? So Honorable Senyon, do the need for you. You're a gentleman. There is a language we don't use here. There is a language we don't use. Right Honorable Speaker, as a lawyer, and as somebody who knows English, the word novice means somebody who is new to a profession. No. The Honorable Balam Barugahare is a new minister. So the word novice is not derogatory in any way except for people who we need to teach some English. You see, you see, on our colleagues, how we start with problems is how we behave. Okay? Look, you know, I know you would be insulted if I called you a novice. The Honorable Baram Bargara is a minister and a free fledged now ex official of this house who has been sworn in. Okay? So. Honorable, I'm a very patient man, and I know you're a gentleman. Okay? Please, let's use. Right, Honorable Speaker. Right, Honorable Speaker. Right, Honorable Speaker, you asked me to speak. Please protect Please. me from these excited. No, you're protected, Honorable. You're protected. I hope I am. You see, in this parliament, we keep learning, and. Um, I am glad to even teach colleagues some English. When you Google the meaning of the word novice, for those that have smartphones and some data, definition number one, a person new in a job or situation. Balam Barugahare is new, the honorable, is new as a minister. So there's nothing wrong with calling him a novice as a minister. I thank you. Thank procedure, you. procedure, procedure. Thank you, Honorable uh, Clerk. I hereby direct you, sir, you expand yeah. the submission of the Honorable Senior. Yeah. Honorable Baram, continue, please. Yeah. Continue. Yeah. Thank you. Okay. Yeah. Uh, right, Honorable Speaker. So, during the appointments committee, I was given a task as a fair person who believes in fairness. Uh, with knowledge of my background as a, a patriot to speak to the president who is appointing authority to stand surety for the young men who, who are detained and they have not yet gone on trial. So the president accepted to pardon most of them who, are not, who don't have cases of murder. And he said security forces should, uh, and, and the intelligence should expedite the investigation uh, uh, going on. So I would request my brother, uh, Honorable Joe Rosenyon, to give, right Honorable Joe Rosenyon, to give me the list. I will do that for you, Joel, and I will make sure the president uh, acts on that. Thank you. Then, okay. Uh, thank you for the opportunity. Thank you. Thank you capitalizing on the energies that the young people have to offer when centralized in the development process. Uh, right Honorable Speaker, I would also like to thank you and the entire leadership of Parliament for the mentorship and support. I also extend my gratitude to colleagues for their goodwill and I pledge that as a representative of the young people, our pace is set. And we look forward to seeing how best Uganda can fully utilize its natural resources to fast track our development. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, Honorable Numbers of Florence. Ebigambo biebio, 
Yes, oyo abadde leader wa opposition wa form lunji no mukuru balambaru gahale. Mm. Ebigambo no babi mugambi etaina cha ina cha gamba. Tacha ina cha gamba ebigambo bamaze okubanga babi mugamba era tongera kujukiza no kubategeza to his excellence the Kenyan president of Uganda haliwa mu naba na Uganda. Never na Uganda. Ranga tu ongelo baju kizanti. Bulichimu tuchiri kuliko jitu ya nzanyo. Omkuru ona rejoicing.